This is the man that Fred Glass said had the it factor. He knew he was his head coach as soon as he met him. Kevin Wilson, welcome to Bloomington. Welcome to IU. Why are you the guy for IU? Why is this a good fit for you? Well, again, for me, I've got a lot of ties. And, you know, the Big Ten had 12 years, you know, three at Northwestern, nine at Miami of Ohio that uh, know the region, wife's from Cincinnati. Worked for Randy Walker for 12 and Bob Stoops for nine, ready to be a head guy, Big Ten opportunity, college town, great environment, ready to build a program. I think the university is making a great commitment to me and going to make a great commitment to our staff. And uh, with the new divisions, we'll see how we do, but looking forward to building up daily process to put together a winner. Give us a chance to compete and play for some championships and have some great seasons. Yeah, Fred Glass said it was important to have someone in here who has had success on the big level. You have great success with the Hoosiers, uh, with the uh, Boomer Sooners. Certainly that offense was great. Tell me on the outside looking in what IU has uh, uh, in, in your mind. Well, to me, we're in a region. We're the state institution. So we should be able to track what we feel is the best players in the state. They want to be a part of something special, be a part of a great school. We're in a region with Ohio and the other surrounding states that's, that, that's, that butt up to Indiana that we should regionally recruit strong. Uh, the Big Ten, the presence the Big Ten has in college football, we should be able to go into some of the speed states, whether it be Texas or Florida or California, to attract some speed. Um, uh, again, we just it's, it's Big Ten football, a great city a great school, and we're going to build something, something that really has kind of been lacking. And I think Coach Hepner was – Coach Mallard had a solid run. Uh, you know, Coach Hepner, I think, was going to do it. I worked with him for a long time, and, and unfortunately, you know, with, 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 with his bout with cancer, it didn't work out for him. But I don't think there's any doubt that we could win, and uh, we're going to win, and, and it's, going to, it's going to be a daily process. We're going to have a five-year plan, a four-year plan. We have a today plan to do our best today and start building a process to put the best program, best team out there and start fighting for championships and playing the best we can. What is the first thing you want to do as head coach at Indiana? Well, we've met with the team and tried to give us a little bit of internal direction with a holiday period coming up. We've got a four-week period, and eight of the conference teams are playing in bowl games. So they're not sitting around. So what are we doing here to not tread water? So that we show up in January and, and start our all-season program early January, we're ready to roll and ready to roll in a positive fashion. So uh, try to give our, our current team a little direction, reach out to our current commitments, and uh, they've picked a great school. I think now they're going to really be excited about what we're going to do offensively, the defense we're going to put together. We'll take some time getting the staff clean and not rush to anything there. Uh, but we'll reach out to the recruits and then, like I say, with the holiday break, take a little time and get the right staff together and give us a chance here to be, make a strong push in January to finish recruiting and start a great offseason. Kevin Wilson, thanks for the time. Best of luck at Indiana. Thanks so much. Thank That's you.